How do? Today I am hoping to finish off the solar. Uh, well, yeah, finish off the solar. And I hope you all had a fabulous Christmas. Mine were crap. It's not the same, is it? You've got to be a kid to enjoy Christmas. Looking forward to New Year. I've noticed people when they put solar up that they drill from the outside in. Like I say, people drill from outside, I can't understand why. So I've gone from inside there. Uh, it's going to come down, obviously, to there. So, let's get on the roof now. There should be a hole. Right, that's where the hole has come through on the roof. Uh, what I'm going to do now is give it a clean, etc. And we rag. Right, I'm cleaning this area here because I've got some uh, conduit, you know, to put the wire in. Oh, you joking. You're not going to believe this, there's fucking wires underneath. Oh, Jesus. You know, and I think I've done some damage to one. Hey, I don't believe this. I've got to put that in a worse spot. Everything I do, I do it for you. Right, this one here, like I say, there's wires there, and I've just skimmed the earth. Now, obviously, these have they've got to be going to the light in the bathroom. But, like I say, I think I've just took the wire, I haven't split it, I am you know, I... Uh, broke it. Close. I put some conduit and uh, I'm going to thread it through. Well, try.
Right, a little word of advice. Don't forget to put the bloody screw things on. In fact, where are they? That off. I'm going to put this ducting in tomorrow when it's all gone off. Uh, it's not, it's just a piece of corner bracket and another one there. Just tidies it up a bit, doesn't it? It just tidies it up a bit. Tidy, isn't it? Wrong with that. Yeah. There we go. Right, it's a case of go inside now and wire it all up. I really don't know how I'm going to film this inside this cupboard. It's just too dark. Yeah, it's just too dark. Um, all I can do is try and show you what I'm going to do and then show you when I've done it. <laughs> That's the only thing I can do, really. Uh, also, that wet patch that I've got at the back of the cupboard, yeah, it's got a lot worse. A lot, lot worse. And uh, I think it is coming from the side of the window from the roof, you know, on the rail, because at the back of the curtain, that's where it's coming down. It seems to be anyway. It's coming down and then running along. You know. Anyway, that's another job. For after I think it, I've looked on top at the rail and there is a crack where the um, sealant and it's just cracked at side. And I know it can get in there. So that's where I'm assuming it's going. So I need some something black. I've only got white. But anyway, right, so what I'm going to be doing is... Oh, it's actually not too bad, is it? Look, look that's that part, it's a good state of it now. It's terrible. Anyway, right, that's another video, isn't it? Right, that's where it's coming. Look, dark. Yeah. That's where it's coming in. What I'm going to be doing is uh, coming down on here. Better from back here, aren't I? I'll be coming down there and then down the left hand side of the charger. Uh, I'll show you in a minute what I'm going to be using. The connector is like a wire connector, but not a wire if you know what I mean. Right, and then down, on, and then up to go into the charger then. Well, there we are. We might make a do in here after all. You see this? Look at that, where the paper's coming off. Anyway, I'll just do the best I can for you. And I just want to show you these. These are what I'm going to be using. Uh, both. You basically, you're putting them into parallel. Uh, both live in and then one live out. Now that there goes to the charger. Right, the wire goes onto these. Then, uh, as far as I know, these are the female. I think. <laughs> yeah, a bit of a disclaimer here. I'm not a professional. So if you blow yourself up, it's your fault. I'm only showing you it's a diary for me. That's all.
Right, so that's both lives going into that and both negatives going into that. Right, I'm just going to show you how we do that. Well, why do you know I mean? You know them connectors that go on the end? I'll just show you. Right, I've purchased some uh, four mil. Uh, solar cable this is rated 50 amp so what I'm thinking is this because I'm putting them in parallel the, this panels these that come from the panels are not 4 mil nowhere near you can see the difference there, look, you see. So I'm just wondering with two panels going into to one, you know, and then that them connectors that I've just done, them wide wire junctions, if you will. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna put this coming out of the wide <laughs> The, the wire connectors if you will right so these are your male and your female like I say I'm not a professional or anything right but I think I think this is male this is female uh, male sorry and that's your female and each of them When you get the set, they come in there with these, and they pull. And I'm not sure which of these goes into which. I think that goes into the female, and that goes into the male. And then when they connect, they go like that. Yeah, you agree with that? I do. So, oh, hang on, there's already one in. Yeah, so that's the female. The one with the hole at the end. And they go into them. That type. Which is the male. Eh? Yeah, that's right. So that must be the male. Yeah. So what, I, what you do is. What I do. But please, I'm not a professional. Alright, so. If you follow me what I'm doing. Then on your own head be it. Uh, yeah. You basically. What I do is measure. Because that there. So there, there. That goes round. The wire. Not the plastic. It'll come apparent anyway. Right. Now this. Goes on there. That goes into there obviously. Hang on. Bugger. That goes inside there. Like that. Okay, you see where this end is? That's where the bugger goes. And then it's a case of working out how your crimps work. I try and put mine the source that goes inside this side here so as when it goes round it actually curls it that that goes in there Oops. How was that happen? Yeah, little bugger.
You know, even with my glasses on, I can't see. They are a bit of a bugger today, you know. They are a bit of a bugger. <clears throat> and that pushes right in, apparently. Like your... Yeah. And this... Like a little rubber thing goes there, and then that obviously screws in there like that. Like I say, I've actually bought a tool. Hello. Yeah, it's coming today, Amazon. And what it is, it goes over this, and then, and then you screw it together. But the idea is that gap that you see there. It's supposed to close it up, but if you've got vice grip, vice grip, <laughs> vice light grip, you can do it. So I've ordered that bloody tool for nothing, absolutely nothing. And I think it's just to make it waterproof anyway. But we've been in cupboard. It's irrelevant, isn't it? Right. Now for the female of the species. <laughs> You'll have a nice Christmas. I said earlier on in video that mine were crap. It weren't crap. It's just, I don't know what it is. Whether it's as you get older you lose the spirit of Christmas so what or the spirit of Christmas is gone you know it's all commercialized now isn't it you know it's, it's I don't know they just know you know I think it was last year I asked my grandson he's no it wasn't last year a year before I think he's 13 14 now so he'd have been 12 11 12 and I asked him why they were Christmas, he didn't even know. He didn't know you celebrated it because of Jesus' birth. You know, and, and I think everybody is, well, they're not getting brought up like that. In fact, that's why all churches are closing, isn't it? Because nobody will go. I'm not knocking anybody because I don't go myself. You know, but that's the reason, isn't it? Everybody's whinging about all these churches closing. But yet nobody goes. Need to help them out, sort of thing. Well, you shouldn't be helping them out, really, should you? Nobody should. Right, this one is a smaller one now. It's uh, a lot smaller compared to the male. Look at the difference in the size. Oh, I can't do this now. Oh. <laughs> Hang on. Oh, for God's sake, here. Yeah. Yeah. Do you agree that it's different? Different size? Yeah, that's uh, female, that's the male. I think. I think. <laughs> oh, dear me. Look, I'm showing you this, right? Well, there's a lot more 
on YouTube better than mine, better than how I'm doing it. You know what I mean? Some of them are professionals and I'm not. Uh, that goes there like that. They're a waste of time to be honest. There is some you can get and they're purposely for MC4 connectors. Did I get that right? I did, didn't I? Wow! Yeah, MC4 connectors. Now I'm a professional. I'm a witcher in. Going away at New Year. Still a bit slack now. I think I've squashed that. Oh, yeah, fucker. I think I've got that rubber on way around. No, I haven't. Yeah, as I say. My version of doing these say the least is crap so I'm just advising you go somewhere else I don't mean that rudely I mean you know somebody who knows what they're doing because like I say I'm only going off what I've watched on YouTube okay right kids now of Cutting these to length. And I think we're ready then to... Oh no, I've got to... Put them into the... Solar charger controller and... Soldier charger controller? Yeah, solar controller. So... I shall put you back in cupboard. <laughs> I'll put you in cupboard now. <coughs> Right, so Right, I'm not going to put these up permanent, you know what I mean, until I've uh... Right, so they're going to come down there It's about there And you're going to go left And then up So they need put in there Right, apparently You're supposed to connect the battery first which is this Yeah 
So obviously we're going onto these terminals here. Right, I'm going to go and put the connectors on for the battery. It came on. Showing 12.6 volts. Just goes to show these Chinese diesel eaters. Maya, that's if this is right. Uh, this. That is showing 12.3. 12.3. 12.6 like I say what we have to do now is connect the solar so in case of stripping these and pop them in there and then it's a case of going on roof Taking the cardboard off. Right, that's it all wired in. Oh, twelve point six. cardboard off the roof and see what happens I'm not going to take you up there if I'm reading it right we're going to this hang on let's turn this off I'm producing 13.3 volts I know it's not a lot, well I'm not saying it's not a lot. That you that there is your is it I think it's what you're using, which will probably be the heater. Right. There they are. Fitted. Uh, happy. Happy bunny. View from the other side. Trunkings in. Bit messy. But I don't care. Can't see it. <coughs> you know what I mean? Okay, okay. This uh, this is the inside. I'm gonna. I'll show you when I've done it. I'm not gonna mess around filming it. I'm gonna pour this into some sort of ducting. I don't know what. But uh, yeah. I don't know what this is all about. Very happy. Happy bunny. 
Right, I'm going in. As I say, I've got lights on. <laughs> oh dear. Yeah, as I say, uh, I'm not an expert, you know what I mean? So, what I've done, whether I've done it right or not, I don't know. Uh, I'm only going off what I've watched on YouTube, etc. So, anyway, if anybody, if it has been any help to anybody, then please give us a thumbs up. Uh, or even better still, comment it bottom.